<laughs> Let's move to uh, picking the 11s that Akash and Brad now have the task to do if they were the men in charge at Pune and Kolkata. You know, Brad is secretly in charge. He keeps texting his buddies in the coaching camps. Mm, I'm, yeah. no, I'm not, I'm just kidding. Uh, Akash Chopra's everyone just listens to what he says. So these are two men that do get it right. Let's just pick the first team now and see uh, whether they've gone for any changes. Both these teams coming off confident wins from their last game. Now, Brad Hawks Pune 11. It's just a toss up between uh, Dan Christian and whether he brings back the New Zealand quick Lockie Ferguson. Otherwise, I don't think there's any change in that team. Of course, uh, he's already mentioned that he'd like Manoj Tiwari batting higher up the order. Uh, why don't you tell me why you've uh, considered Lockie Ferguson, uh, Bradley Given Dan Christian is, uh, among other things, Australian. Off you go in 45 <laughs> seconds. <laughs> well, I think Dan Christian, uh, all-round ability. I think he can r r really be a power player out the death if they need uh, that batting option. I just worry about Stokes and Doney. Um, taking up too many balls and then Tawari having to come out and uh, be more attacking or more aggressive than what he has to and you've, you've got that cover there and Akash and I were talking off show with the uh, option of Ferguson. Um, Ferguson's a quick bowler, can be very attacking in, and the Col Kolkata Knight Riders are pr predominantly an Indian batting lineup and uh, generally Indians don't like high pace bowling so they might go that option of Ferguson to really get stuck into that middle order of the Kolkata Knight Riders batting. All right, Indian and one West Indian at the top who'd also, who also mm. might like uh, some short stuff. Yeah, well, uh, I wouldn't utilise Ferguson you against no, Noreen right. okay. in the first two overs, but if Noreen gets away, then bring him on. I'd take the risk of uh, one of the bowlers getting Noreen out early, mm. and then you've got those four overs for Ferguson to operate against um, certain... Indian batsman. Okay, let's see what Akash Chopra has gone with as far as his Kolkata team goes. Does he make any changes? Do they need, uh, you know, maybe maybe less batsmen given their bowlers are getting teams out for 49? Nope, he goes for the uh, exact same team as I can see. It. So there's no place for Trent Bolt or Shakib Al Hassan in this team. Akash, 45 seconds for you to explain to me why you've gone with the same team against Pune. You know, I've got uh, now five bowling options uh, plus Colin de Grandholm. So obviously, obviously, I've got a lot of bowling options. That's what uh, Kolkata always does. I was uh, like uh, thinking about Shakib Al Hassan in place of Colin de Grandholm, but I just feel that there has to be some amount of consistency with regards to picking your 11, unless uh, you know that okay, this player cannot play spin or this player cannot bat against uh, uh, faster bowlers. So that tactical move I can't see or I don't really envisage happening. So I've just gone in with the same team. Uh, don't change if it ain't broken. And this team is breaking the backs of uh, other teams and uh, obviously are in a good space. So they look all right with the team that they fielded against RCB. Very well. Thank you very much, gentlemen. Now, I won't have Akash for this uh, pre-show. So why don't you tell me your prediction, Kolkata or Pune? At Pune. Uh, Kolkata Knight Riders. Mm. So to break that little streak, Paddock, you keep your prediction with you because I'm going to keep that suspense until we have you at our 7.30pm show. Always a pleasure. Thank you both very much. Make sure you tune in then for that 7.30pm live show on ESPNTrickInfo.com as well as on uh, Facebook every day of the tournament. Use the hashtags to send in your comments and questions to our panel. And uh, you, if you are watching us on our Facebook page, make just uh, tune in to the mid-innings show from the 8pm game. We're live every day to take your questions and comments to Akash, uh, Brad, as well as Ajit Agarkar. If you're watching us on YouTube, subscribe to us there. You have nothing else to do if you're watching us on YouTube anyway, so do this at least. Right, we'll see you again soon. Until then, bye-bye.